Welcome to Mala Collective, where we aim to educate on meditation, mantras, and mala beads. In today's video, we're going to answer the question, what's a mala and how do I use one? A mala is a string of beads that has traditionally been used in prayer and meditation for centuries. But you don't have to use it for prayer and meditation. You can simply wear a mala as a reminder of an intention that you've set for yourself or something you're trying to manifest. If you do want to use your mala beads in meditation, that's called japa meditation. I'm going to show you how to do that right now. In japa meditation, you take the malas and face the tassel towards yourself. You take the mala in your hand, making sure not to use the index finger, as that represents the ego. Turning each bead in your finger with your thumb, you repeat a mantra to yourself. This mantra can be said out loud or internally. It can be as simple as the word love, or an affirmation such as I am love, the word grounding, or a phrase I am grounded, whatever you're looking to cultivate in your life. When you do get all the way around 108 beads, you'll reach what's called the guru bead. This is the bead between the tassel and the mala. This represents a time for pause and reflection, honoring your practice, your intention, and your guru. In caring for your mala, we suggest you occasionally wash it to rid the dust and dirt from your rudraksha seeds that build up over time. The rudrakshas will get darker as you wear them, as they absorb your oils and your energies, which actually makes them stronger. If your mala does break, we believe in sending your mala back to Bali once to have the karmic cycle repaired. It's a sign that the intention you're cultivating in your life is no longer one that you need to cling to, and it's time to set a new intention. When choosing a new mala, think about what are you trying to manifest? What are you trying to create for yourself? You can look at the intentions of the gemstones, such as rose quartz, believed to open the heart to love, or turquoise, which protects on a journey. When choosing for a friend, consider the same intentions. What are they looking for in their life? What adventures are they about to go on? Remember to let your intuition guide you and to let it be a fun and organic process. Your mala beads are a beautiful reminder of the intentions that you're setting for yourself and what you're trying to manifest. Treat them with love and kindness and respect. Thank you for joining us at Mala Collective. For more information about mala beads, meditation or mantras, visit our website or our YouTube channel. Namaste.